back in ETV. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in and welcome back to Balcony TV Los Angeles. I'm your host, William Reed. Today we're reporting live from W Hollywood and joining me all the way from Los Angeles is Nona. How's it going? It's going good. Thanks so much for joining us today. Of course, thanks for having us. What are you playing for us today? I'm playing a song called Other Ways. It was Other Ways? The first single we put out last month. Beautiful. Take it away. Babe, I wouldn't know The way that you act The way that you show Spending the night Just to wake up cold Get close to you And then let go But the drinks They make it easier For me to let go Oh, let your God go And I don't Want to be that guy that lets you walk in and ruin my life So I'll go, but you know that I'll be coming for you You know I want to have it other ways Not the same as if we were kids But I'm okay to wait the right way I know that you like to play those games You followed me, remembered my name and it feels like you want it bad Take two steps forward and then one back If I could, then I would i tell you everything I know you want to have it other ways Not the same as if we were kids I'll be okay Wait the right way You know I might not want it other ways Not the same as if we were kids But I'll be okay You know I'll wait anyway Well done. That was awesome. Thank you, good that was awesome. Thank you. Um, tell us, tell our viewers about the inspiration behind that track. Oh uh, shoot! Uh, you know, romance, bad romance. Yeah, failed you, romance. I think you kind of picked that up. I think that was the, the, those elements were pretty evident. Now, was that just um, was that a fiction, fictional inspiration, or was that something based upon like your real life? That it's a, it's like a twist of fiction on something that's really happened. I feel like that's kind of. the for me, the best way to write, because it's like, oh, it's real, and then you can change it, so, I don't know, you can't be so mad at one person. Okay, and uh, that was a single taking off of your uh, last album, which just came out not too long ago. Yeah, so I, I put that single out, like, about a month ago, and it's kind of the first release leading up to an EP that'll come out early next year. So I'll be putting out music throughout the rest of the summer, fall, 
leading into next year, a couple more songs to come out. Awesome. So we're definitely looking forward to that. In the meantime, I mean, as, aside from this project, Nona, I mean, you are involved in a lot of different side projects. How do you find the time to balance, um, you know, artistically? Uh, it's just whenever I'm home. So it's like I, I kind of try to separate it more like work and then Nona. So playing with other people is a lot of fun. And then as soon as I'm home, it's kind of all, all on Nona. And you're originally from Los Angeles. Yeah. How does uh, the city itself inspire you as an artist, if at all? Um, I, you know, that's a good question. I used to hate living here, and then when I started touring a lot more, I f realized it's a really good place to come back home to. And, it's changed uh, a lot in the last few decades, yeah. definitely. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. You find, you find good spots. What are some of your other favorite places to play? Outside of Los Angeles? Absolutely. Uh, it's always, I mean, I used to hate playing San Francisco, but I think that was because I was playing the worst places to play in San Francisco and people were mean. I, it's just about getting, I don't know, being around nice people in a nicer venue. Is, sure, is nicer. Uh, that all makes sense. So um, you have a new album that just came out. Um, you have an EP coming up later uh, next year. Mm -hmm. um, you have another new single coming out next month. Yeah, uh, yeah. What else is in the works for Nona? Um, you know, building content, fan outreach. Um, just like this is a good time for me because I have material to release in the fall and I know I have stuff to release early next year so it's really just a lot of writing preparing for next year cool uh, now back to the name for a second Nona um, that's something that is close to home for you yeah it's my grandmother it's what I call my grandmother her name is Dorothy but we all call her Nona okay yeah. so you stole your name so you stole her name basically. yeah yeah she's real upset about it yeah and, uh, well I hope she's getting residual royalty checks yeah I send the checks every month on the first it's just not that much right now or at least a monthly phone call yeah yeah we have we have lunch every month so it's a standing standing good man date. now now last uh, but not least before we wrap this up you guys um, have a great sense of style I love your fashion sense uh, your shirts was this planned the, uh, the whole tropical thing yeah well uh, yeah yes we were on our way over here, and I was like, what are you wearing? I mean, he was like, what should I wear? And I was like, do you have a Hawaiian shirt? And Because uh, I have this one, and I love this shirt because my mom hates it. She's asked yeah. me to burn it. Oh, it's it's an amazing shirt. Got to imagine. Yeah, I mean, it's, anything that can inspire that much passion for someone must be worth well, having. Well, next time when we have you guys uh, on the show, you have to give me a heads up, and I'll wear my Hawaiian shirt. Oh, yeah. Okay. No, well, yeah. All right. <laughs> now, uh, before we wrap this up, where can our viewers find you guys online? Well, all the socials. You have Instagram, which is Nona the Nona the band. Twitter is also Nona the band. Facebook is Nona Sounds. Are you guys in Snapchat? Uh, yeah, that's a little confusing. It's Nona the man. Snapchat. It's Nona the man. Because I was going to name the band that when I started the Snapchat, and then I didn't. So awesome! Thanks so much. <laughs> Congratulations, and uh, best of luck. Back to you, reporting live from W Hollywood. This is William Reed for Balcony TV Los Angeles. Signing off. Balcony TV.